Welcome to Apathetic Weekend Update. I'm your host, guy who will recklessly spend $100 on groceries and try and pack them into only one plastic bag to save five cents. Our top story tonight. This week, many more comedians came out of the woodwork to pile on accusations that comic sensation slash provider of enough vocal fry to open up a teenery, Amy Schumer, had stolen some less than imaginative premises from them. Marking the first time this many people have been proud to be unoriginal since whatever the shit this was last week. Moving on, on Monday, a dog in Alabama escaped her owner's property and accidentally completed and placed seventh in a half marathon. Is it just me or are they running out of ideas for Airbud? Like what's next, right? This week, presidential candidate slash guy I'm running out of alternative names for because he's in the news more often than a horoscope, Donald Trump was quoted as saying he could shoot people in the streets and wouldn't lose a single supporter. But admit it, if he said, you're fired, right before he shot, you might have to vote for him too. You're fired. Bang. In reefery or news, uh, not that one. No, that's Kiefer. I know, right? I miss me some Jack Bauer, too. Ah, uh, I don't... Nah, who is it? Oh, snap! Corey Hawkins from Straight Outta Compton? No oh, way. Well, wait, that doesn't make any sense. Uh, how do I put this? Um, okay, Jack Bauer, he broke like a shit ton of laws in L.A. Uh, but he was white... So, if he were black, 24 would be one episode long, and 15 minutes in, he's already wrongfully in a precinct for jaywalking after a terrorist. Yeah. Sure. Ooh. One of the stupider bits I've done is close to calling Amy Schumer's writers. Quick life hack, bad posture, just hang around your work crush until your fake posture becomes your real posture. Bonus step, use the pickup line, hey, do you know where I can find the nearest chiropractor? It being almost a month since he left, I thought it might be cool to check in with the ghost of my former roommate. Erickson? Hey, what's up, buds? Ah, you know, doing well. Uh, you? Got ghost aids today. Oh, shit. That sounds awful. Oh, no, it's not like that. Ghost AIDS is the opposite of regular AIDS. It's the best. Getting so much afterlife p these days. Oh, uh, well, then that's cool. Yeah, gotta run, though. Getting a booty call. Don't you mean a booty call? Gonna pretend like you weren't as lame as you just were, so I don't have to avoid you when you die. Yeah, fair enough. Later. Moving on, Avatar 2 has been delayed again. Presumably until people forget how forgettable Sam Worthington is. In Reefer ER News, this week the co-founder of Microsoft tragically tore up nearly 14,000 square feet of protected coral with his yacht. Or as Microsoft put it, finally something we've done that might make people forget about Vista. On Tuesday, fearing a mass shooting, a man in Seattle brought a gun with him to a movie theater and accidentally shot a woman. But hey, wasn't a mass shooting, so technically success. Also, the lady was going to see Alvin and the Chipmunks road chip, so really he saved a life. You're fired. Bang. Oh, no, 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 wait, 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 wait. What if... Bang. You're fired. Right? Should the, should the fire come before or after the gunshot? I mean, before is pretty badass, but after is also pretty badass, as long as there's witnesses. Ah, it's a tough cookie to crack. After widespread media reports of an ISIS app that sends encrypted messages, many militants were excited to test it out, only to find it had never existed in the first place. Revealing America's newest counterterrorism tactic, Disappoint the enemy until they're too depressed to fight. Phase two of their plan? Box sets of recent Kid Cudi albums. Ugh. Savage. This week, Chinese scientists confirmed they had created autism in monkeys and had started looking for a cure. 
Fingers crossed it turns out to be vaccines. This week, over 3,700 cases of Zika virus-linked births were confirmed in Brazil, meaning either the deadly infection that causes babies to be born with small heads is spreading, or Brazil is gearing up to add limbo to the Olympics this summer. 29 episodes of Apathetic Weekend Update, but I'm fairly sure that's the joke I'm going to hell for. <sighs> Come on. You guys, the graphics have gone sentient again. That's it for your Apathetic Weekend Update. If you made it through the video without rage snapping a pencil, please like, comment below, share with your friends, subscribe, and uh, yeah. I've been your host, guy who's been told he dances like regular people seizure. Good night. You're fired. Pow. You're fired. Pow. You're put on suspension. Pow. Yes,